Ma'am, why is your underwear up there? Not a bottle. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Was that so? <laughs> why is he half naked? What's going on? <laughs> Woo, it's been a long time since I've recorded anything. Uh, I got a new haircut, by the way, so my hair's short now. And um, yeah, a lot of things has changed for me. Which I'll talk about that a little bit later, but hey, let's get back to Kiryu or Joryu and his adventures. Hey internet, it's Jessica and welcome back to Like a Dragon Gaiden. In the last episode, Kiryu, Joryu, uh, headed over to Sosenbori to uh, deal with the whole mess that he is in right now. And uh, we are with a lady named Akame who wants to help us. So I believe we have to do some of her side quest stuff. And a lot of you were telling me to like, try to finish most of it. I'm gonna try my best, okay, to like, do most of them. Um, but I'm excited to see what we'll find here. All right, we gotta raise the network levels. Let's get the F out of here. So like, what do I do? Is it the exclamation marks? What's this guy doing? Blah, my stomach. Any chance you could bring me a stamina light? Looks like there are a lot of pay. Maybe I should get them a stamina light. Okay, requests. Oh, so you get points and then money. That which is good because I also need money. I I realize that I haven't been able to like upgrade a lot of his stuff because I don't have money. So Okay, hang on. Can I like not buy something the vending machine? Oh, okay, I'll come back for that. What are these people doing? Young people these days always caught up in their damn smartphones. You better pay the uh, pay for the bento you ruined by bumping into me, buddy. I ain't your buddy, you old fart. Oh, okay. Sure. Hey, didn't anyone ever tell you to respect your elders? <sighs> what are ya? The grandpa police? <laughs> Alright. This freaking guy in the red. Oh, I just ruined my health bar. Oops. <laughs> Barely had to do anything there. Alright. Why, thank you, young man. Maybe this ain't gonna be so bad after all. Alright, cool. Nice. She said level 3, I believe, right? I think that's what she said. Ah, my favorite ball! It's gone! Looks like his ball got stuck in a tree. Oh, where's it at? Oh, I can get that. Wait. There we go. Here, kid. Here, I got your ball down for you. You really are a hero! Oh. No money, but hey, at least uh, we get some experience points, so that's not too awful. Let's see what else I can- how Wait, how many people on the- Damn, there's a lot of people out here. Alright. Let's go over here. Hey, old man, how about you give me some money instead of hoarding it all to yourself? What? Who are you? The dad hunter? Oh, okay. It's not cool to harass the middle-aged. That's so. Only got an eye on you, old man. <laughs> I feel like Kiryu took that personally. <laughs> I feel like he took that personally. <laughs> oh, God. That guy was, like, flopping like a fish. Oh, you're coming at me with a knife! Come here. That guy should be dead. He should be dead. Thank you for saving me. I'm never coming around here again. Nice, 50 now. Oh, damn, I'm getting a lot. Yeah, I need to do more of this because this is good for me. Ma'am, why is your underwear up there? I got your underwear? Oh my, thank you. I'll be taking it now. Bye. <laughs> what? <laughs> so weird. Nice work. Um, good work out there, Joryu. Akame here. Heard you have been working your ass off lately, really doing a lot of stuff for the network. That's just what I was hoping for. I got some stuff I want to ask you to do. So, can you come see me at the office? I'll be waiting. 
Uh, okay. You know what? Effort. We're gonna get this. So heat actions cost a hundred, a hundred thousand yen. I'm just gonna get the small ones for now. Jodiu. Great work out there, Jodiu. Looks like you're getting used to the whole patrol thing. It'll really help me out if you keep going around and leading a hand, lending a hand to those in need, and wrapping up the levels in the Aquina. I will do that in between episodes. Uh, if something interesting happens, I'll, I'll record it. But just, just to save for time, okay, guys? I'm gonna try my best. <laughs> Right, uh, I'll just do that. Also, thanks to your patrol efforts, seems like the townsfolk know that you're with me. From here on out, whether you go to do any activities that might draw attention out of town, that'll end up being free advertisement for the Akame network. What do you mean by attention? <laughs> like, going balls out on food or playing some games, all sorts of stuff. You doing all that really puts a smile on the store owners and townsfolk. That means me heading to over to the karaoke bar because I need to go back there. <laughs> That's so. Though I'd rather not stick <laughs> out. Uh, don't be like that. I'll be keeping tabs on your activity log if you get me. All right, cool. Nice. Yeah, and then she mentioned that there'll be rewards. Anyways, changing the subject, you know, but I got something urgent I want to ask you. I think you can handle it. Something urgent? Like what? I got a bad feeling about this. Oh, come on. It ain't bad. Just look over the quest for me, would you? Okay, so request jobs directly from her. Reward, you'll get Akame points and money. Alright. Okay. I guess we'll just do this one, right? Emergency request? Long story short, I need you to hit up the cabaret club. Oh, I didn't expect that. <laughs> yeah. New place called Club Heavenly opened up nearby. They're calling it a real immersive cabaret club. Now, I've played a lot of Yakuza games. All of them, in, in fact. When you say immersive, does it mean what I think it means? Oh no, I'm gonna get demonetized. <laughs> immersive? What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Beats me. Think that's what the client wants to find out though. They got a deadline for a magazine article coming up and they need someone to get over there and toot sweet a report back. Cause I'd go myself, but... <laughs> Why do that when I got a secret perv who knows all there is to do? Oh no, about the cabaret club. That's you, by the way, Jody, your son. Secret perv? Me? Oh, I guess I. <laughs> I do have some experience with the cabaret club. Loki! I want to say Kiryu is, but at the same time, he's not because he's such a gentleman. But, like, you know, the, some of the mini games, he has some questionable, like, interactions. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> See, I knew you were the guy that really jumped. So go have yourself some fun and film me an after, yeah? Uh, right, I'll try. I'd be lying if I say I wasn't curious, and it might make for a nice change of pace. I think I'll pop this in the new club. Alright, let's go over there. I'm sure this will be fine. Again, I'm low-key scared. <laughs> Who's just chucking silver plates at the rooftops? What's going on? Crap. I need a item. Can I pick something up? Ow! Not a bottle. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> was that salt? I thought that was like a bottle of a drink or something. <laughs> the hell? That's new. Anyway, let me get some food in me because I'm getting the hell beat out of me. Oh, Smile Burger! Um, let's get let's get a combo. Let's get a combo going on here. いただきます。よし、行くか。ナイス。ありがとうございました。Is this it? Oh, here we go. Club Heavenly. 
I'm sure this will be fine. Hello! Welcome to Club Heavenly. Our service costs at 10,000 yen, including coverage, charge, and service fees to selecting a hostess. Would you like to proceed? <clears throat> Cabaret, huh? Should I go for it? I mean, this is our job right now. I kind of have no choice. Uh. uh, yeah, I'd like to go in. Excellent. Right this way, please. Oh, no. I'm scared. Oh. <laughs> I knew it! I knew it! It was going to be real girls because I'm just like, I know it's going to be this. Okay. I know her. She's a streamer, right? And she's a really big fan of, like, Yakuza as well. Like, I've seen her a couple of times, so... We're gonna have to pick K. <laughs> oh, God, I'm scared. She's cute, though. <laughs> Here we go. This is what do I have to do now? I remember doing like the dates in Yakuza 0 and I was really bad. <laughs> Sorry if my Japanese sounds like, sounds good to me. I can be your speaking partner. Are you okay with handling- Wait, I can be your speaking partner. I gotta give Kiryu some riz. I Which he does have. It's just he's not good at using it. Yes. <laughs> okay, that worked. That worked. What would I like? Oh god. Um. Damn, bro, I don't have money. <laughs> Give me a whiskey. <laughs> I bet uh, you would get more points, obviously, if you spend more at the cabaret. Cheers, That's how it works, bye. right? I don't have a drink! Um, hobbies, adventurous palette, Kansai dialect. Hey, let's talk about adventurous things. この間、お友達と居酒屋行ったんですよ。そこで初めて食べたものがあるんです。なんだと思います。<laughs> Uh, cheese, mochi, spicy fish roe? Bro, I don't know! Oh my god, I'm just gonna pick this one. Oh, thank god. <laughs> That's good, girl. Good for you. Okay, let's talk about your hobbies. How about that? <laughs> Do I have hobbies? <laughs> yeah, you know, honestly, it would be karaoke for Kiryu. I know he does like pocket racing and whatever, but let's be real, it's karaoke. <laughs> He's got a good singing voice, so he should not be ashamed. Give a present. Girl, I don't have anything. Sure. Oh, God. What can I give her? Bro, all I have is food. Girl, you want some... <laughs> you want some crackers? What do I give her? I'll, I'll give her this. Oh, my God. A present? Thank you. <laughs> Out of time. Leave club. Did I pass? I think I passed, right? Alright, did I do it? Oh, gosh. Finish checking out that club. I should report back to Akame. Uh, uh, okay, I think I did it. I don't know. can't believe my present was fucking cake. What is wrong with me? Jonya! Well, howdy there, Joryu. What's uh. up? I went to that cabaret club. Ooh, the immersive one, right? So, how was it? Immersive? I mean... Yeah! <laughs> uh, yeah, it was. It was more captivating than any club I've ever been. The girls felt so genuine. So, yeah. <laughs> 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 the place didn't feel seedy at all. The opposite, actually. Quality place like that. I can see it really catching on. Huh? That 
That's Joe to you, son. The secret pervert for you. Don't hear a peep out of him till he goes to a cabaret club. Then he gets awful chatty. Hey, I only went there for a job for you. <laughs> oh, you're too easy, Joe to you. I'm just pulling your line. Thanks. Here's your payment. Nice. I'll tell them you're a really. I'll tell them some. I'll tell them it was really something to write home about. Till next time. That takes care of that. The place is really nice, though. Now that I've been for work, maybe next time I'll go for. <laughs> this freaking guy. Oh my god. Nice. Hey, we got. Oh damn, that's good. A hundred. Jodie. Great work out there, Jodie. As thanks for completing my quest, I'll give you a special bit of info that I've been holding on to. Look for the pad next to the building toilet of the Bishima. Bishima. Bish. Bishima. Bishima. Bridge. <laughs> Follow it and you'll find yourself back to the black market weapon shop. Black mar market? So it's that kind of place. <laughs> Pay a visit and see for yourself. It ain't a place just for anyone, but a flash of red tiger and you can stroll right in. A guy with your strengths and weapons like that? Phew, your opponents might as well call him sick. Not a bad place to spend your money after you earn it either. I'm sure you won't regret it. I don't really need advice from you on how to spend the money, but thanks for the info. <laughs> It should be, uh, be night by the time you get back from the shop. We'll head to the castle then. Oh, perfect. Okay, cool. So, like, hmm. Wondering if I should, like, go mess around with, like, mini games or something. I don't know. Wait, what is out here? So, this is Shogi. The gambling hall. Kiss shot billards and board. Where is, um, Pocket Racer? Where the hell is that at? That's somewhere. Club Heavenly... Golf. Oh, maybe it's a Club Sega. Hang on, before we go. Sorry, I, I just want to look at the mini games because like sometimes KDU's reaction is pretty hilarious. Uh, here's Club Sega. Alright. Oh, oh. Where is pocket racing? I really want to do it. Win a UFO prize? Okay. Oh man, I'm not good at this. I'm going for this one. Oh, I did not pick that up, bro. How are you supposed to get that? Damn! Oh my gosh. How do people do this? You know, I've never won a claw machine ever. Heat action, or like save it for like a boost attack or something. Face, you know what? F it. We'll get one at least. He's fine! Kidu doesn't kill people, guys. Don't worry about it. I'm sure he's okay. He can walk it off. Where the fuck is the food at? I need to eat something. <laughs> the black market weapon shop should be around here somewhere. This guy's completely plastered. It's not my job to look after him, though. I'll leave him be. Uh -huh. Hey! 
What are you staring at? I ain't some circus sideshow. I'm a legendary weaponsmith, and don't you forget it. A legendary weaponsmith? Oh. You? Yeah, what the hell of it? I'm just surprised. Do you normally go around shouting about this like this? Huh? What are you trying to say? Uh, uh for someone who works in the shadows, you're awfully quick to blow your cover. Uh, <laughs> well now. Did you folk hear me say that and think I'm just some old drunk off his rocker? Uh -huh. Seems like you're different from the rest. Someone told me about me. Someone told you about me, eh? Uh. Yep. Yes, Akame said I should show you this. Mm. Oh, a red tiger. So akame chan is taking special interest in you, huh? Sure, I guess you could put it that uh. way. But does not matter? Uh, what does is how long you're gonna sit there. How about we take this into your shop instead? <laughs> <laughs> if I could get up my own, I would have done that already. Sorry, pal. Mind giving me a hand, then we'll be right to business. Uh. All right, not like I have a choice. I feel like Kiryu is so like frustrated in this game. Because usually he's pretty patient with people, you know, even if they're like kind of weird and stuff like that. I've noticed that he's been less and less patient this time around. And I know there's somebody's life on the line, but you know what I'm saying. I see now. You're the kind of guy who just says, uh, who can't just say no, huh? Seems like Akame-chan got her beck and call. Uh. Yeah, because of that I have to take care of an old drunk. In the future, I recommend not getting wasted in the middle of the day. <laughs> Get a point there. Just a little boring when there's no customers to Boy. serve. Being in the underworld doesn't mean you can't lead a healthy life. I know we just met, but you have me concerned. <laughs> Cho to you, was it? You're a lot more considerate than you look. I'll take that as a compliment. Oh. Right, now I'm gonna show you something good. Here's my shop's pride and joy. So, what do you think? Hmm? A drone? Cho? Yeah, it ain't no regular drone. One press of the button, you can summon the whole squad to support in your battle. <laughs> I call this Sketch of the Hornet, named after it sounds dangerously buzzing wings. That sounds familiar. <laughs> Yagami! <laughs> Hornet, huh? I like the sound oh. of that. I know you would. You can tell this baby here will attack your opponents, or you could use it to distract uh, and disorientate. But rather than listening to me prattle, why, don't you sh why don't I show you? Keep your eyes peeled, pal. <sighs> and this is just to help me in battle? I'm not sure I'm really understanding. Uh, mind letting me uh, letting me try it out? Mm. Nah, I don't mind, but that doesn't mean I'm gonna sell it to you. Huh? What does that mean? <clears throat> Tools on a good person who wields it. If you can't use it properly, then you ca I can't let you buy Jody. it. So the weapon ain't what it's needed for testing, it's you. Uh. you. I see, I understand that. Uh, you have a pride in what your craft. And because of those standards, you only serve a specific mm. customer. But did I carry you to the store when you were too drunk to do it yourself? Don't I deserve some credit for that? <laughs> you were strong enough to get the red tiger, weren't you? This should be uh. easy. Come on, let's go outside. Best way to show you this is how it works in the blood pump and brawl. Mm. Fine by me, but are you sure you're okay with that? A moment ago, you were so wasted you couldn't oh. stand. Relax! I used to be a fighter like you, striving to reach the top. So treat me like an old damn drunk and we'll go... So treat me like an old drunk and you'll be in the world of hurt. Huh? Alright, come at me, Jodio. Pretend I'm your enemy. Fight me like you want to kill you. Uh, keep it down, old man. We're just here to test, right? There's no need to draw attention. <laughs> I was a worry before I was a weapons man. That chance of a good fight will always get my blood bubbling. <laughs> I see. I'm supposed to get blame you. But if we're gonna do this, then I won't hold back. I will bring the same fire as you. Oh, okay. Hello? Anonymous combat auxiliary drone powered by AI can be summoned by holding triangle. When you switch to Yakuza's Isle, all drones are- Yeah, it should be with agents. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Oh, so you can just summon as many as you want? That's kind of interesting. Okay. Damn, he kind of hits hard, the hell? Oh, I can't hit him with a bite. Interesting. Oh, shit! Oh, God, I gotta go. <laughs> Damn, he's 
good. So that's fascinating, so I can just summon most- I thought it'd be like one at a time, that's what I thought they were gonna do. <coughs> oh, what the hell is that? Are you alright? Sorry, I might have gotten too far. <laughs> Nothing to apologize, your strength is shivering down my spine alright. You use that drone that well. You must be a hell of a fighter. <laughs> you know, feel like you? You can make it all the way to the top, just like you I, I always dreamed of doing. Mm. Yeah, that's the real potential you got there. But, where the heck have we been hiding? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. I think it's mostly beginner's luck. I'm nothing special. Oh, don't say that! Yeah. Nah, it's about your ability to use the drone. I realized something as I watched mm -hmm. you fight. Oh, what was Jury. that? Those were Daijoji techniques you were using, weren't they? That means you must have been one of their agents. Yeah. I have no clue what you're talking about. Never heard of the Daijoji, and I'm definitely no agent. <laughs> He's so bad at lying! Uh. Uh, I get it. You gotta play dumb. Say what you like, but I know what I saw. <laughs> After all, when it comes to Daijoji combat techniques, I wrote the book on them. Literally. Nani. What? I uh, didn't introduce myself, did I? My name is Akira Mizo Mizoragi. Nothing but a starry-eyed fool who spent his days wandering the world's underground coliseums, putting his life on the line in the quest of greatness. Learned a lot of new techniques as it went, so I started a side hustle teaching them youths, military groups, and anyone who has been interested. Oh. One of those Daijoji factions, uh, one of those was the Daijoji faction. Would have been all well 20, year, tw 20 years ago now. Long story short, after seeing the way you move, I know without a doubt the familiar Daijoji techniques. By the way, that wire you're using, I gave it to one Daijoji too. Oh. Uh, the weaponized wire gadget, spider is what uh. I called it. Is that so? Guess there's no use pretending mm. then. Yeah, I got plenty of rare combat mutuals in the st shop. Not to mention a few master works. I collected during my days of travel and training. Here, you can learn the arcane arts and the altercation I've never taught the Daijoji and bargain a price. Let me add them to your catalog. Nice. Anyhow, meeting a guy with your talents makes you feel like destiny must have been at play. Mm. Ne needless to say, you pass my test, the drone's yours. Won't even charge you for it either. Well, that's nice. If I could, I let you use all my merchandise on the house. Nice. Yay! Oh, before you head back to Akamachan, uh, there's one more step you need to take—an extra special place that it tells all best customers about. Go look for a smoke shop. Tell the lady you're working there that uh, Mizu Mizuragi sent you. She'll give you something real good. I'm sure a fighter of your talents will find use uh. for it. In that case, I'll pay her a visit. Where do I find this smoke shop? South of Buzaman Street. The la lady who runs it is a friend of mine. Don't forget to tell him Mizoragi sent you. Alright. I don't. Got a minute? I'm Joryu. Mizoragi told me to come see oh. you? Oh, yes. I just spoke with him, actually. So I know all about mm. you. Great. He said if I came to you, you have something useful for me? Oh. That's right. But whatever, whatever or not it's actually useful, it will depend on how you use it. Uh, I'm starting to get the impression you're no ordinary lady selling cigarettes. <laughs> you don't say. But wouldn't it be best for both of us not to ask too many questions? <laughs> now, here's what I have for you. Okay. Huh? First time I've been surprised to get smokes from at a smoke shop. <laughs> oh, don't worry, honey. These aren't your standard cigarettes. They're furiously flaming fireworks. Mm. Furiously flaming. Ah. Oh. Would you look at that? A perfect target to test them out on. I can't stand boneheads who litter in front of my shop. Oh, okay. Sure. Wait, can I just throw it at them and they explode? Because that's kind of funny. Ah. <laughs> oh. Oh my god, it is! Now watch closely. At a glance, it just looks like an ordinary cigarette, but it's much more. You don't even need to light it. All you have to do is toss it in the nasty little Yakuza litter bug and... <laughs> ah! The hell was that? That's quite a cigarette. Does it seem powerful, though? Like a mini bomb, kind of? Yeah. No, it's furiously flaming fireworks. 
Well, whatever you call them, they don't seem like the something you could toss out in the middle of the town. Hmm. That's why I rarely give them out. But since Mizuragi-kun sent you, I'm making an exception. Ah. Huh. The weaponized cigar cigarette gadget Firefly is what I call it. All right, cool. Uh. Got it. Since you went through the trouble, I'm grateful to accept. How much will they cost me? <laughs> oh, it's Mizuragi-kun's treat, dear. He seems to be head over heels for you. So save your thanks to him. <laughs> I thought she was just gonna casually murder that guy, honestly. <laughs> seems like all I need to do, um, it's late enough into the night by this point. Should head back to Akame's place and get ready for the castle. No idea what kind of place this or what might be waiting for me there. Better prepare the best I can. True. And it happens to be a popo right there. I need to I need to know how to unlock like more slots so I can put this. I'm assuming this is what I can give to the ladies too. But yeah, I need to unlock more slots so I can equip more um clothing and stuff. Come on. Wait, I want to use the the cigarettes. Hang on. <laughs> That's funny. Anyway. Okay, this is a new song and I haven't seen this yet, so let's see how it is. Oh. I love that they have new songs for this game too. Oh no, I missed! This voice is so good, at least. Oh my god. I don't know why I'm so bad at this one. もしたたばこにロマンチックな雪が降りもう<笑><笑> Oh no, I missed all of that. My god, Kitty's doing a Christmas song. Oh my god. <laughs> I love it. My score was so bad for that. Oh my gosh. Come the hostel. Oh, they have the true hearted samurai on here. This this flippin' song took me out. I'm just gonna say that right now when I played it in Ishin. 
It's a remix! This song is really hard. Okay. I think it's a little bit easier because there's not ladies in the background distracting me. to is about like Kiryu respecting women. <laughs> That's the funny thing about it. I think I did better this time around. I don't know, someone go look at my Ishin video. Did I pass my score? Because <laughs> I don't remember. Oh, I locked new abilities. Cool. Oh yeah, I'm gonna need all of that. Ooh. Sticky threads. Oh, I need- oh my gosh, I need to get everything of this. Okay, hang on. Extreme Hemo, Kiwami attack. Can I get this? Oh, because I got Akame points too, that's why I can unlock it. Oh! That's interesting. So either I pay money or I or I use um, her points. That's pretty neat. Not gonna lie, that's pretty neat. Okay, I'm gonna get this. Counter my knockdowns. All right, cool. All right, guys, I'm gonna end this episode here. Sorry, it's a little bit short, but I have a feeling the next video I'm going to the castle is gonna be quite long, so. I'll make that episode longer. But yeah, this has been really interesting. Um, so far, we got some new moves, which is great. Kiryu's still bad at lying. And uh, the mini games are great, especially the karaoke. I appreciate the new songs. That was pretty funny, though. Uh, so yeah, we're going to head to the castle next and see what will be there. Because it just seems like a really huge thing that Akame is talking about and like you know, mentioning, so I hope she will help us, continue to help us, instead of just, like, making fun of Kiryu. <laughs> anyway, if you guys enjoyed this episode of Like a Dragon Guy, and remember to leave a like, please let me know in the comments what you think, and be sure to subscribe and hit the bell button so you guys know when I upload the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!